Okay. <laughs> Hello, my friends. How you doing? Actually, I should be asking you how you're doing. Hi, Dana. Dana's Hi, here. Yeah. <laughs> and we're wearing our love shirts because right. it's Valentine's Day. And we are going to share some love. We love love. Yeah. We love it a lot. And uh, we're here today with some exciting news because... It's time! We're going to raffle off another one of these Priority 600X bicycles. Ooh, yeah. The Priority 600X. The sexiest bike this side of the Mississippi. Maybe even on the east side of the Mississippi. In Alaska, too. Who knows? Maybe the entire world. Anyway, you want this bike? It's hard to get. You know, supply chain issues and stuff. But we got one set aside for you. All you gotta do is buy some raffle tickets. A whole lot of raffle tickets. And this baby can be yours. We're talking pinion, gates, ren fork, and that really cool Get Out There logo. And just a reminder, we did this last year. It was super successful. Dana, how much did we raise? $44,997. Dollars, American yeah. dollars. And I shouldn't yeah. say we raised it, you raised it. You were yes. all so generous and you were yeah. buying those raffle tickets. And so just a quick overview, you buy these raffle tickets and it puts your name in the entry block of like thousands of other people and then they pull a winner. So any of you could win this bike. And it's awesome to raise money to win a bike, but it's yeah. also awesome to raise money for the KRD Foundation, which is where all this work goes to do what we do, which is put kids on bikes. Really quickly, what's the KRD what's Foundation? What's the KRD? Yeah. Um, it's the Kirk Rocky Derricksweiler Foundation. And my brother Rocky, um, I donated him a kidney. It, you know, he had a great life. Uh, cancer finally took it and my heart was broken, Ryan. Mm -hmm. And the only thing to do with a broken heart the way to heal that is with love. And so I started this foundation with things that he was passionate about, which was getting outside and getting kids outside and kids on bikes and yeah. giving them everything that we get yeah. from riding bikes. Yeah. And I think you get probably too. We all know the magic of bicycles. And my whole goal with all this is obviously to get kids on bikes but to get kids loving bikes at an early age so that they keep that love throughout their lives and just have a healthy lifestyle and something fun to do, healthy to do, good for the environment. As we all know, bikes are just yeah. the best. It's good for the world. It is good for the world, yeah. for the environment, for everything. We're saving the world one bike at a time. You're saving the world. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. So we raised a lot of money last year. Dana, where did all the money go? We do the kids holiday bike giveaway for Community Cycles. And Community Cycles is here in Boulder. It's a Boulder nonprofit. And that's like three or four hundred bikes. We also consistently help out the Pueblo Boys and Girls Club. Why Pueblo? My brother was from Pueblo. Thanks for asking. <laughs> yep, and yeah. Uh, yeah, so that's great. We love to uh, help out that community. Also, this year, a bulk of our money went to indigenous communities, which I was really excited about. Of course, we've supported the uh, Blackfeet Nation. Up in Montana. Yeah, Cheyenne, um, boys and girls. Yep. Um, and then we had a new one in the Navajo. That, yes, Kids. we gave money to a Navajo youth bikepacking group run by John Yazzie out in Arizona, very close to where John and Mir and I were riding this past November. And his whole mission is to get Navajo youth on bikes, outside, loving up on nature, sleeping under the stars. So and we were ever able to give him a, a very good chunk of money. And then another new one that I was really excited about is the Cycle Effect. And this group empowers young girls yeah. mountain biking. Hello, Dana. My name is Yara Melgarejo. I'm a senior in high school and have been with the Cycle Effect since seventh grade. I'm going to be completely honest, when I first started the cycle effect, my self-esteem was so low and I wasn't super into it. I was so terrified and I thought it was too hard for me. My parents made me stay and I was so mad at them, but now I realize it was the best decision I've taken to shape me to be who I am. Being my last year as a high schooler, I've realized a lot of things. I still have growing to do, but the cycle effect has shot up my self-esteem and it has made me realize I am capable of anything. I still have that voice in my head telling me I'll never be good enough. 
but the cycle effect has helped me silence that voice. I understand that with work, commitment, and perseverance, I can really amount to anything. And it's so important, like, um, you just get so much confidence, you know, when you're, you're outside, you're in the dirt, you're riding bikes, like, it's, I think, really important for all young people, but this one focuses on young girls. Young girls, and that makes me happy because, yeah. you know, I, most of the audience out here right, watching this right now are, are men. Most people that ride bikes are men, so I think yeah. we need to get more ladies on bikes and just yeah. make them feel more welcomed into the sport. So we're really excited about the, the new things that we were able together yeah. to raise money for and help. And uh, I also want to give a shout out to Priority, of oh, course. Yeah. They donated the bike and the bikes, and um, they also, you know, David is just such a sweet guy. Like, yeah. Ryan and I love him. You know, he's so great. But uh, we had a special request this year um, with the Pueblo Boys and Girls Club, mm -hmm. and uh, Dave was able to let us help Santa out with yeah. some kids that got new bikes. Yeah, lots of so, new Priority yeah. Kids bikes yeah. with the carbon belt drive. Yeah. You know, they're the best. Yeah, Priority, yeah. whenever I've ask them for help on any kind of fundraiser, they say yes without even thinking twice about it. They are a wonderful company. You know them fairly well now if you watch my channel. And again, their mission is to get more people on bikes. And uh, I love them. They're absolutely wonderful. I ride their bikes too. I love them. <laughs> and they're good humans. And we think that you're really good humans too. So <laughs> yeah, this is a whole community of good <laughs> humans here. want to ask you once again to you know go out there buy some raffle tickets you may win which is really awesome and if you don't you're just a really awesome person and you're still you're, supporting something yeah, great you're helping us do this so yeah what else you got i don't really have a whole lot else to say other than i will link the fundraiser below in the description of the video click on that it's going to be live for about a month Please share this with everybody, even if they, they're not on my channel, if they're not subscribers. It's a great opportunity to get your hands on the Priority 600X. Yeah. This is the bike that I designed in conjunction with Priority and I've ridden on the Great Divide and so many other adventures. It is a rock solid bike. It retails for $3,500, so it's a, it's a very nice bicycle. And maybe I will uh, I'll sign whoever wins. The he Bible. will I'll sign it for you. He is going to. And if you don't want me to sign it, yeah. sign it. I won't sign it because maybe you want it to look pristine. <laughs> no, he's going to sign it. And um, one more thing. One more thing. I know it's been a rough couple of years. Like that's really how we started doing yeah. this fundraiser. But I don't know about you. I talk to Ryan frequently, so I do know. But I feel like it's getting brighter out there, folks. I mm -hmm. feel like it's getting lighter. It's getting brighter, spring is coming, and we've got this. Good things are happening. Yeah. Good things are, are happening. And again, thank you from the bottom of my heart yep. for all your support on this channel and, and everything and just watching my videos and commenting and, uh, you know, it's, it's a total privilege to be able to, to have you as an audience yep. and to uh, create content for you with wonderful people like Dana and we're going to do some adventures. And thank you. Ryan. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I mean, Ryan lets me use this channel, which is amazing. So thank you. You're welcome. Okay, we so are going to do some adventures. Let's do, let's, let's raise a ton of money. We raised what, 45,000 last year. Let's try to raise even more 50, 60, 70. Who yes. knows? Share yes. this, share this, share this, yes. share this. And thank you. Thank you. Bye. Let's give him a kiss. Mwah. Mwah. Dana even wore lipstick <laughs> for this video. I know. She was all fancy. I have on shiny lip gloss. <laughs> <laughs> Love you all. Thank you.